<laughs> Welcome back to the huddle Ooh. brought to you by 956sports.com, served by McDonald's on Fox 2. Time for everybody's favorite segment. It's our pick segment. And gentlemen, my crystal ball has been a little foggy. I'm not going to lie. So I'm going to rely on what you guys say. Doc, let's start with you. Thursday night action, Donna at Edinburgh North. Can the Cougars pull off another late victory? Well, they better not wait until the last two minutes because Donna is tough. Donna starts that road swing we're talking about in the spotlight. North needs to play better early. I feel like they will. It'll be highly competitive. I'm going for Donna on the road, though. All right. Coach? Edinburgh North, they struggle against Edinburgh. You know, it, it's, it's tough, but Donna has been dominating all year, and I'm going to go with Donna. I think Edinburgh North was looking past Edinburgh, trying to get to Donna. Yeah. I'll take the Cougars at home on a Thursday night. Rowe is at Westlico. That Rowe offense, Rowe defense last night seemed to be clicking. Can they do it two straight weeks? You know, Rowe is tough. They, they have a pretty good offense, right? But Westlico's defense is pretty good, and that slot T, it's hard to stop. I'm going to go again with the Panthers. I'm not going against Tony V and Westlico. Doc? This is hard because Westlico does tend to get going and gain momentum as the season goes along. I mean, Rowe can score. Westlico now shows they can score. I don't think they lose at home. I think it's a good ball game, but I think the Panthers win at home. All right. Los Fresnos travels to J. Bogus Stadium in Harlingen to take on the Cardinals. Can the Cardinals keep up with Los Fresnos? Well, this is their chance to put, all, put to rest all those fears about whether or not they're good or this and that. You know, they can win this game at home. They'll be 3-0 and in district, and they'll be in great shape. I think Los Presnos has too many athletes. I feel like John Michael Rosales, that Ford, built Ford Tough Player of the Week a right. couple of weeks ago, I think they're going to do it on the road. And unfortunately, I'm probably going to go to the ball game. I hope I don't get by no coins from the people <laughs> up there in the stands. You know? I'll take Cardinals in on this one, Coach. You know, Los Presnos is playing good, some good ball, right? Uh, mm. But once a Cardinal, always a Cardinal. And I'm going to go with Harnge in this Look one. at that. <laughs> hey. Puro Cardinal. Gruya is coming to Hidalgo to take on the Pirates. I, I like Hidalgo in this one. Shane Patterson saw a little action. Um, I think they're going to do very well. You know, I think that uh, Ray Peña Blanca for Gruya is one of the best quarterbacks in the Valley. The extent to which they get other kids involved and the extent to which they can play defense will tell the tale of the game. I'm picking the home team, Hidalgo. How much does it help that Abel Gonzalez is the coach of Gruya, a great quarterback in his own, that, in his own time? That helps a lot. You know, Abel's a good coach. He's a good athlete. Start off with questions for you. That's point. true, yeah. Coach Gene calling the Gators over the Pirates. PSJ Memorial at McCallum Memorial at Veterans Memorial Stadium. There's a lot of memorialization going on. I'm going to tell you what. Both teams need to win. Memorial comes off the off week. They're going to see if they can get uh, Trevor Spates in space a little bit and get him the ball outside. PSJ Memorial, that's the strangest deal the last two weeks. I don't feel like they really have played as well as they could. They had that big high and then they lost a couple. Uh, I'm going to pick Macau Memorial at home, but it wouldn't surprise me to see the Wolverines pick it up. He's getting ready to go back. And yeah, well, you know. Yeah, McCann Memorial, you know, they've struggled. You know, they've struggled. PSJ Memorial struggled. They've struggled. So it's, it's which way do you go? But I, I like the offense that PSJ Memorial is putting out. I'm going to go with PSJ Memorial. I agree with you, Coach. I'll take Gus Galatas and the Wolverines over the Memorial. Mustangs. Lyford at Rio Hondo. Bulldogs, Bobcats. I like the three A's. The Bulldogs, they, they came down to a close one, and Orange Grove got past them 36-35. Orange Grove is unbeaten. They're 5-0. That's a decent club. Uh, Rio Hondo starting to turn it on. They got a lot of weapons. Valladares is one. Uh, I believe Rio Hondo gets the win, but Lyford will score some points. Coach, this is tough to pick. I mean, yeah. Lyford or Rio Hondo, you know, I'm going to go with Rio Hondo in this one. We're going to take Rocky James and the Rio Hondo Bobcats. And that's going to wrap up this edition of The Huddle. Don't forget, log on at 956sports.com. Hit us up on Facebook. Let's get close to those 5,000 fans and join us next Sunday, 9.30, here at Fox 2 for another edition of The Huddle. Brought to you by McDonald's and 956sports.com. Ooh. I was ready for that one that time. I got it. I was ready that time. I saw you lift the arm. Uh,